So we're probably getting a new map in Valorant soon, as Sunset is well over 6 months old by now, and this player card in the current battle pass depicts a location we aren't familiar with. In case you weren't already aware, the final player card in the battle pass is almost always a teaser for what's next in Valorant. As a quick lore recap, this symbol right here in the player card belongs to an organisation that we know as the Scions of Hourglass who notably featured in the Reckoning cinematic from a few months ago. This is also related to how Omen and Clove met each other as they stumbled across this journal that Hourglass were also after. With that information in mind, take a listen to this recent voicemail from Clove to Brimstone. Hey Brimstone, I've been helping Cypher with a journal I, the one Hourglass tried to steal. There were some bits in there he couldn't figure out, something about a secret cavern or some such. And that got me thinking about some things those hourglass numpties let slip when they hauled me aboard their wee little boat. You'd be amazed at what some people say around a dead body. Yapping on and on about bringing the journal back to its rightful place in the Elder Grotto. You see where I'm going with this? The journal's talking about an hourglass base. A special one too. Size getting the ship's navigation logs. We'll suss it out. Just you wait. So the journal itself references a secret cavern, while the hourglass operatives mentioned an elder grotto. So this cavern or grotto is an important hourglass base according to Clove, and they say that Cypher is preparing to find the space. So I believe that then leads us to this player card, where you can see Sage descending into some sort of cave, of course with the card literally being called Underneath It All. Another teaser we have is in the background of the upcoming Nine Market, as the theme there normally alludes to upcoming content, and here we're in some sort of underground structure. So if we put all that together, it does seem like the next Valorant map will be some sort of grotto. I'm using the location in Fortnite there as an example, as probably most people will be familiar with. But yeah, the map should be some sort of cave that the Hourglass organization has fashioned into a base. Now I want to say this map will release next act, which is in a little under three weeks. However, that's not confirmed and it's just what I'm assuming. We also have to wonder what's going to happen with the map pool. If we're adding in a new map and already have three currently sitting on the sidelines, which ones are going to be shuffled around to make room? if Ryder sticking with this whole 7 maps thing. I'll probably make another video in the coming days talking about the map pool situation in Valorant, but in the meantime, let me know what you guys make of all these teasers leading towards an underground map coming soon.